Crystal Dynamics, if you have a panic button, now is the time to hit it. Don't gently hit it either. Hit it like these fake YouTubers hit the overreact button, pretending every bit of news is the most exciting thing in the world. If you have heroes in the pipeline good to go, put them out now. Black Panther, Captain Marvel, War Machine, Falcon, Winter Soldier, if any hero is even close to ready, release them now. One a month is not going to help this game survive, and adding an extra robot factory will not save this game. This is not how a player base should look the same month it's released. Let me help. You know what you should do when you're making a live service? You should throw in some social features. Because right now, Marvel's Avengers is pretty low on social features. Users like Mystic75 are out on the subreddit right now stressing the lack of these features and how the PC player base is suffering as it breathes its last breath. Matchmaking issues across all consoles in a game that should have had crossplay, no social hub, no text chat, no in-game friends list, no matchmaking playlist, no way to change the difficulty in the damn lobby or even back out of a mission without leaving the fire team, no repeat mission button, the list goes on and you already know what my list looks like, but that's only if you're interested in this game's longevity. Destiny got away with a lack of content at launch because its hamster wheel was fun. And most importantly, Destiny could be played with friends six years ago. When you're reloading checkpoints, hoping that this time it works, you can't find people to play with via matchmaking, and you're supposed to play a 40 floor repetitive ass robot fight alone? You realize that this game and your capacity to play it over any considerable amount of time is being actively sabotaged. Dynamics. This game desperately needed a patrol mode to land, stumble across other real people, inspect them, text chat, potentially team up, fight respawning enemies, find respawning chests, kill high priority Marvel villains for a chance at high loot drops, but this game doesn't have that. Combat and the skill depth are effortlessly the best part of Marvel's Avengers, but every other category fails. Locations, ass. No Asgard, Latveria, Atlantis, space, Wakanda. You could have dressed up one room to look like different locations for harm room sessions, but you couldn't even do that. Villains, ass. Taskmaster and abomination, that's it. MODOK can only be fought once in the single player mode. Think of all the C and D list villains you could drop into this game. One villain a month? Mm -mm. Y'all gonna have to do way better than that. Missions? Ass. And the artifacts can't be shared across heroes? You've lost your mind. This tedium is way beyond anything that anyone would tolerate, especially when the categories are so lacking. I would say the cosmetics are ass, but instead, no ass, because ass would actually be welcomed. This is what Marvel Ultimate Alliance got going on. This is what Marvel Heroes has going on. This game's selection of skins are trash, boring, lazy, palette swap skins that are easily so alarming that it'll make you wonder, is this really a Marvel property? Do y'all not have like permission to use anything? It's a pathetic helping of shrug worthy cosmetics enveloped by the gargantuan shadow of over 80 years of Marvel source material in comics, TV shows, movies. Y'all got so much to pull from, but this is what y'all got. No different shields for Captain America, no different hammers for Thor, Red Hulk isn't in your game. It's been made abundantly clear that women are not capable of being sexy. That is forbidden. Only men slay Captain America. Your wallet has never been safer. Emote so dry Shapiro's wife would say, God damn. Do you want to wave? Do you want to clap? 
that's the kind of 20 year old emotes that this game has to offer and there's no emote wheel so you better find one emote that you like enough to use it because that's the only emote you're going to be using because you can only use one at a one at a time baby one at a time the skins are so bad in this game that people aren't even complaining th that you can't get it outside of the one mission that gives you the pattern the one time my dude you know the patterns that can give you duplicates by the way there's no way to earn skin patterns outside of that Oh wait, actually, you know what? Hey, let's go through the subreddit for this game right now. My treat. The enhanced throw makes Cap less accurate. A video posted by Timid Observer One. You know, I recall showcasing this in the beta, but of course, People told me, it's just a beta, bro. And other hilarious uh, apologies for this game. I'm sure people are still finding ways to gargle those balls. Right? Meow. Can we PC players have our voices heard about the fact that matchmaking doesn't work at all? It's been this way since the first beta. I think this is enough now says user mystics75 i referenced him earlier he just outlines many things that a game like this could use to stop it to stop it from dying my word why does it feel like every new looter was developed by a team who has never played one posts user alex p keaton honestly I can't think of one looter who got it right at launch. Destiny, Destiny 2, Division, Division 2, Diablo, Anthem, etc. Arguably Borderlands 3 is pretty decent, but even they were missing things. I'm sure they go into talking about builds and how we should probably have a locker or a way to save our builds. That's still not here. How inconsistent a lot of the loot is and how hilarious and, you know, insane we'd have to be to hope without winning the lottery to get a good drop. Oh boy. An emote wheel would be a nice quality of life update, says Avengers Game Feedback. Wouldn't it though? You know, I'm pretty sure I made a post like this back during the beta. Yeah. Yes, I did. AIM is definitely getting smarter. Instead of building deadlier robots, they just flat out remove the elevators. Posts Spark 2110 ITA. Nothing like playing some Marvel's Avengers, only to realize that things aren't going to be working the way that they should be working. Get down there, Thor. Get nice and trapped when the wall materialize. Oh, oh, okay. I didn't know that two hulks. This guy gets... Your mom lets you have two hulks? Please make patterns drop from somewhere reliably. Yeah, yeah, it's finally it's finally starting to become a problem. And to be honest, if most of us got drops these days, we'd probably just hoard them because psh, there's nothing we want from the characters that are in the game right now. And there's no skins that we want in the game right now. You know what I'm oh my lord. They could drop from XP rank ups. Faction... Fang, fang. Oh god, this 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 game is getting to my brain. I, I better knock this off. A funny thing happened to me on the way to the helicarrier. There's Bruce Banner and Hulk. Man. You know, up until now, I'd never seen those two guys in the same place. But, you know, I guess all the theories have just been conspiracy theories. But this is just a theory. A dead game theory. Oh, you shouldn't have went there. Ricochet Rogers? Was this just a collection of glitches on this subreddit? Is that what this is for? This is what this page is just for, huh? Somebody else suggesting an emote wheel? Oh, great. Mm-hmm. Here's what, here's what that could potentially look like, guys. Ugh. Obsidian cap. Look at that someone's dad in Riot Gear skin. Pretty dope, right? Now, when I, when I look up Captain America... You know, we're naturally going to find... I, there's no point. There's no point in me Googling it. We already know what we're going to find. Some dope-ass comic book skins with the scales and the wings on his 
on his head, we're gonna find Captain America from the, the movies that have been dominating the last decade, my dude. But we're not gonna find something that is in any way similar to the type of look that we have in this game. And you know what? That's fine. Somebody else is suggesting, hey, can we add a second cosmetic vendor to the game? The vendor ain't the problem. It's the lack of cosmetics therein. We could talk about this all day. Is this it? Is this game even gonna make it? To Spooderman? Oh no. Fs. In the chat. <laughs>